Welcome to this YouTube channel. In this video we are going to talk about Maddox Furniture. So before starting this video like this video, and subscribe to our YouTube channel for future updates. Maddox Furniture Manufacturing Company. The Maddox Furniture Manufacturer was a vintage, furniture company best known for their historically themed desks, which offered both big secretary and writing desks. Although the company ceased operations more than a century ago, its furniture remains highly sought after by vintage furniture collectors and homeowners. Concerning Maddox Furniture The Maddox Furniture Company was established in 1865 in Arstown, New York. The company began as a small family business, and quickly evolved to incorporate a larger production and an expansive catalog. The brand's signature item quickly evolved into historically styled secretaries and desks, for which the company is still best known. Maddox Executive Desk The History of the Maddox Furniture Company Little is known about the Maddox Furniture Company's founders. At least five members of the Maddox family, who also had a porcelain and ornamental item manufacturing firm, launched the business in 1898. According to some sources, the business was started primarily by William Maddox, the son of an English immigrant. William Maddox achieved a number of accomplishments during his lifetime. Along with his furniture goods, which he initially marketed under the name Maddox Tables, he developed various furniture manufacturing machinery that he sold to other manufacturers throughout the country. Indeed, he was one of the first American furniture producers to patent an invention of his, a machine for polishing tabletops. Maddox was able to create and develop a niche for beautiful secretary desks and tables in New York State due to the abundance of forests, developed railroads, and other furniture cabinet businesses in the area. Maddox, like other New York furniture businesses such as Kling, Harden, and Stickley, established a reputation for quality solid wood furniture sourced from New York forests. By the late 1800s, the business had established a reputation for historically inspired designs. The company's historically inspired pieces featured Tudor-style desks and 18th-century tables that were lavishly adorned with black lacquer and gilded. In other instances, historically accurate works were deemed fine replicas and were labeled Maddox Colonial Reproductions. The corporation maintained its success. However, the Maddox family sold the company to the Shermian Brothers Company in 1919. To my understanding, the Shermian Brothers Company may have continued to market and sell Maddox furniture throughout the 20th century. To be honest, I've never seen a piece of furniture labeled Shermian Brothers, Therefore, I'm inclined to believe that Maddox Furniture became more identifiable and memorable for the company's desk line. Maddox Furniture Manufacturing Company A Maddox's furniture label, replete with the company's signature bull logo. Thus, numerous pieces from the 20th century bear the designation Maddox Furniture. Indeed, the Maddox Furniture name was resold to the Crawford Furniture Company in 1978. However, it appears as though the Crawford Furniture Company ceased operations in 2012. Products of the Maddox Furniture Company Throughout its existence, the firm manufactured dozens of distinct pieces of furniture. Naturally, its most recognizable pieces are its desks and secretary desks, which were inspired by or in some cases, exact replicas of existing historical pieces. These historical pieces vary in design and size according on the year they were inspired, and whether or not they are accurate reproductions. Multiple Maddox secretary desk versions were manufactured from the 1920s until the 1960s. Naturally, the models range from the most basic to the most sophisticated. Several distinctive elements may be found in Maddox secretary desks, including the following. Tops for bookcases with glazed glass doors. Drawers in the serpentine or block front style. Exquisite finials and broken arch tops inspired by the Federal period. Legs in a variety of styles, including ball and claw and Queen Anne. Woods of exceptional quality, such as mahogany veneers are inlaid parts. Interiors of elaborate desks, with several drawers and cubby holes, often called pigeonholes. Brass hardware solid brass. Confidential compartments. Obviously, the larger, more stunning, and finer models incorporated all of the aforementioned features. Indeed, the most expensive Maddox secretary desk models required advanced carpentry skills and several weeks of labor to complete. After all, in many magnificent homes, the secretary desk serves as a status symbol. In 20th century homes, fine furniture by Maddox company exhibited taste and money. Maddox table. Secret compartments are frequently featured in Maddox furniture's higher-end workstations. 
Along with its historically inspired desks and secretaries, the company offered a much smaller selection of accessory pieces such as side tables and smaller desks. Suggestions for purchasing Maddox Furniture If you're interested in purchasing Maddox Furniture products, you'll need to hunt for used options, as the company is no longer operational in any manner. Thus, your best bet is to conduct an online search, or work with a second-hand furniture dealer who can assist you in identifying and purchasing historic pieces from a particular business. The price of used Maddox Furniture Company items varies according to the specific piece, the year it was manufactured and the piece's general condition. However, you may anticipate paying between $300 and $500 for a typical Maddox Furniture Company desk. Thus, if a Maddox secretary desk has a basic front, a few drawers and doors, and is in good condition, this price range is reasonable. If you're seeking for historical reproductions, or pieces with more intricate mechanical operations, you may have to pay a premium over a simpler antique writing desk. For instance, Maddox Furniture Company secretary desks with concealed compartments, and similar features frequently sell for at least $800 and sometimes more on the used furniture market. However, it goes without saying, that the condition of a vintage Maddox desk can also make a difference. What do you think about this video? Do let us know down in the comment section below. If you enjoyed this video and want to hear from us again, be sure to hit that subscribe button before you go.